Hi, everyone, it's from Galaxy S4, Root.com. For this week's Galaxy S4 ROM of the week, check out Graviton ROM. Available for at and Mobile, Canadian, and GTI 9505 S4 users. Also, can be installed uh, on the at and Galaxy S4 with SafeStrap Recovery. Make sure you use the SafeStrap Recovery version. There's two different ROM versions. Uh, everyone else can use the regular version. Now, if you're looking for a very good minimalistic custom ROM, um, that's running on the latest Android 4.4.2 firmware uh, and also slightly themed. Definitely, this is the great ROM for that. Uh, based on the latest Android GTI 9505 firmware, um, you'll get goodies like a hotspot working out of the box. Um, just go to more networks and enable hotspot if you want it. Um, that should work out of the box. And also, this has a complete removal of bloatware such as T Mobile bloatware, ATT bloatware. Uh, you name it. Um, there's just the apps you need, which I really like. And um, I've been hearing from people daily on how laggy their stock Android 4.4.2 is after they updated. Um, so best way to fix that, um, you can remove the bloatware yourself or install an awesome ROM such as this because uh, you have everything you need with Samsung features still, um, but you don't have all of the bloatware. Um, it's going to speed up your phone. Um, also give you better battery life. A uh, Graviton ROM also comes with uh, some customization as you can see here. If you go into custom settings here, um, you'll be able to fully uh, customize your status bar like I have here. I'm using a battery bar instead of an icon. Uh, or you can go ahead and choose uh, from an array of great icons here and you can hide the battery bar. Um, but the reason why I got rid of the battery is to save some space in my status bar. Um, so let me go ahead and set that to none and show this. Now you have all of this space and you can go ahead and uh, uh, change the colors. Also you can move the clock to the center, enable AM PM style, days of the week, uh, all that good stuff. And there is uh, this thing called App Ops, which allows you to set permissions uh, individually for uh, many different apps. Uh, for example, this may be useful uh, if you if your kids are downloading some games on your phone and it annoys, annoys you uh, with game notifications, I have like one game you install, it's like I have get like 100 notifications per day, then you can go ahead and here and, uh, and disable, disable the notifications uh, for that app. Now there's different um, settings, every app has different uh, permissions, um, so that it's a very good feature for that. Uh, Graviton ROM, as you can see, comes uh, themed in nice blue. Uh, sort of like AOSP. Um, also, for those of you uh, who want to run TouchWiz touch uh, without losing all of your AirView, all that Samsung stuff, um, this is definitely one of the ROMs that comes close to it. For at and users with SafeDrive, this may be a great deal because you can remove most of the bloatware. And also, it does come with even a KitKat launcher that you can use. Um, sort of make your phone as run close as possible to AOSP ROM. Um, so very good stuff. Overall, Graviton ROM is a beast when it comes to uh, performance and also gets very, very good battery life. So definitely, if you're looking for such a minimalistic TouchWiz ROM, definitely give this guy a go this weekend and do let me know what you think. Uh, and that's it. And as always, if you have a Galaxy S4, don't forget to subscribe to my email list at galaxys4root.com. And thanks guys for watching my video. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and the subscribe button below here uh, to get more cool ROM reviews, tips, tricks, and more. And also check out video of the week over here if you haven't yet. And as always, uh, stay on Android.